And Swans will hold it back through Hayward. That's Cox on Coleman Jones, so that's a learning for him right there. Piercing ball towards Franklin, and the big boy marks it. Hasn't kicked a goal the last two weeks, only the third time consecutive weeks, but hasn't kicked a major from a tight angle. He's kicked one now, Bunny with the opener for the Swans. Parker, slick hands, ends up with Heaney. They go again inside from Clark. McLean stands underneath. It is another big unit. Another big man will have a shot. So lucky. Short and effective. Yeah, you take that. On his distance. From about 46. Hits it well. Hits it really well. And the Kangas get there first. And the skipper loves it. Lucky comes again. Now Robottom to Franklin. Plays on Bart, he's got a man way ahead of the footy in Laddams, this is going to be interesting, Pete runs in, runs in, runs in, and nails it! Campbell's at the fall of the ball, Shields tries to grab it off him, Curtis does grab it off him, Fox grabs him, Curtis gets away, gets away from Blakey, lines it up from the pocket! Oh, that's as good as you'll see! And up and under, inside 50, Blakey, there's a whistle though. So it's going the way of four. Under it, through it. He loved it. My word, he did. And the Kangas have got two in a row and two of the last three. That's why there's the repeat entries. It's difficult to work their way through. Goldstein just punches it to clear the area. Wardlaw again goes to his knees, keeps the ball in, centers it. Nice! To Goldstein. I'm reliably informed the third tallest. <laughs> Says a lot for a ruckman as well to be able to play 300. Yeah. Behind Jay Madden and P. Salmon. Here's the Swans moving forward now. Campbell from 45 out on the run. And the Swans with the immediate reply. Keeps it in front of himself. Really well robed. Coming back the other way. Goulden immediately caught an attack. Good defence. Zeeble spirals it out of defence. Hectic passenger play and back to Parker. Let's do it all again, Howie. His 99th game as captain. Only missed one game in the last five years. Luke Parker hits it sweetly from outside. Luke Parker with a hand in the air. Heaney, feigned the hand pass. Got Papley up ahead and Hayward elects to go for the ladder. Hayward puts the afterburners on. Hits 50. Hayward drives it all the way to the square. And Laddam, as he marked it. Forward ball, Larky in the area, had a couple to beat. Drury out to Coleman Jones. Quick response from the Kangaroos. Immediately sends it out of defence. Tough one to gather, Larky and Blakey, good contest. Francis gets himself involved, looping hand pass. Oh, oh Wardlaw is absolutely collected in the middle of the ground by Haywood. He's hit hard, the young man, he's trying to get to his feet. The second time, the big man, 210 centimetres on debut. Gordon, free kick. He's looking to kick his second of the afternoon, though, from directly in front. That's the start. North Melbourne were after. Eddie pops it inside 50 towards Larky, pushed wow. underneath it. Falls to Larky. There is Curtis, clever tap. Coleman Jones, Sheasel, Sheasel! Two in a row for the Kangas. Sydney are under pressure, McLean's been good. Marks on his knees, gives it off to that man Parker again. And there is Bart. McLean sends it forward, Bart is he out the back, he is! He's gonna play on Buddy Franklin, he's kicked free! Buddy's got free, firing up the crowd. Plays onto his right, little low slider, worked out nicely to Phillips. Maybe a touch fortunate as Phillips passes inside to Scott. Still making mistakes, but the ability to clean it up or tidy it up through pressure. Goldie grabs out of the ruck. McAndrew snapping for his first goal, had a set shot. Warner, four goals for the season. Warner kicks his first for the afternoon just to give the Swans a bit of breathing space. The Swans have lost their last four, the Kangas the last seven. Tight tussle, Saturday afternoon football, Larky's got some toe, gets out the back, Larky 
He's got the handball option. It's good in front of Stevenson. Runs into an open goal. Dribbles at home. Now Blake, he loves to dash through the middle. This is good footy from the Swans. Into the path of Heaney. He's got the big boys deep. Elects to go on the left. Goes to the pocket. And a good lead by Hayward. That's the Isaac Heaney that we love. Sheldrick is the sub for the Swans. Yet to be deployed. Adams looks sore in the middle of the ground. Whether he got a knee on knee knock, it doesn't look good. We'll get back to that shortly. Oh, yeah. Just landed on Todd Goldstein's foot. The former Hawks are just waxing at the moment. Shields and Howe. Now Ford sends it into the path of Larky. It's a good mark, too. Larky, normally so good at this part of the game. Hits it nicely. It's a beautiful kick from Larky. It's got the legs. Double cobra from Nick. Yes. And here come the kangaroos. He slips it out to Sheasel. High ball. Tough one to mark. Curtis is in the area. Falls to ground. There's a whistle. Did Coleman Jones. He's kicked one this afternoon. Important kick. Important kick. And he nails it home. Three point game. Lowe's there to mop up McDonald. It's pinging between 50s at the moment. Now he's got Curtis ahead of him. It goes back. Finds Simpkin. Now Powell. Here's a big moment in the game. Set sail. Powell! And the Kangas are in front. Francis. Coleman Jones. Hits Larky. The snap from Larky. It's hooking. He might have snuck it through. Nick Larky has. Three in a row for North Melbourne. This is where you want Sheasel inside 50. You want him lurking around these contests. Here is Sheasel. Right on cue. Harry Sheasel. Deep ball. Big Ruckman's gone forward. McAndrew can't impact the contest. Golden low ball. Accurate ball. The game just keeps getting better. Swan send it forward. Good contest. Comes to Heaney, the dangerous one. Heaney from 45. Isaac Heaney! Five. It looks it's like they're still pretty much 1v1 all over the ground. It looks like there might be a blood rule. They're just checking. Umpire's having a good look at it. He's speaking to someone, the umpire. Free kick, okay. Hey, you have to do your free kick for an interchange breach, and it's a 50 metre penalty, okay? Paying Let's a free kick. Pay. Paying a free kick and a 50 metre penalty, penalty. to McLean. Extraordinary scenes, extraordinary scenes under the roof. Kangaroos fans spitting chips. From directly in front, McLean gives the Swans the lead. But he sets himself, spills out the back, across the line it goes. The Swans break a four-game losing streak. They break the hearts of the Kangaroos. It'll be talked about, it'll be analysed, it'll be discussed. But the Swans get the job done.